Salutations, people. Thank you, Jay. I'm here with Chloe. Chloe, speak. Chloe. Come on, Chloe. Anyway, so... <laughs> you can't tell me what to do. I'm a free person. <sighs> Fine. Anyways, um... So, four hours ago, Mikhail was uploaded the this episode and I just happened to wake up to it. I'm just like, oh, come on. It's we so early in the morning. I, I know. You set a fucking alarm. We all know you did. Yeah, I sent a, I, I did an alarm. <laughs> so far as it goes. <laughs> no, I'm joking. So, um, yeah, but yeah, she did. Actually did this four hours ago. So, yeah. Um, anyways. Um, let's play. What's your name? We all know what our name is. It's Odom, of course. Oh, them! <laughs> I would have never believed it. No matter how many times I looked back on it, I could have never imagined it. My entire world was my entire world was now full of magic and wonder, and it was all because of one person, Diana, a succubus. Diana was the one who caused my entire world to change. Actually, it was kind of the boys. But... Yeah, I was about to say that. <laughs> it was yeah, it was the boys, but I guess she is the one who kind of taught her everything. The voice didn't really teach Well, Diane is actually awesome, so, okay. <laughs> oh, wow! <laughs> I thought you liked well, Sam. Yeah, I do like Sam. He's also cool. And maybe, uh, Matthew. But other than that, nah. I like nah. James. Nah, nah. He sucks the most. I mean, he would have been a kind of, um, uh, he would have been the canon route, actually. Well, I'm glad he's not. If Sam wasn't, then, then James was. <laughs> I'm um, she was the only one who brought the boys to my home, and... And, to and the incident, the inciting incident of the change in my life. She showed me magic and life beyond the world, the human world, and I would forever be grateful to her for that. However, one fact still haunted me. <laughs> Diana was also the one who murdered my grandfather. Oh, wait, that? We're talking about that? Oh, I thought it was going to be about Sarah cries. No, she did murder her grandfather! <laughs> Yeah, I know, but we have more important things, like beating Sarah with a bat. What the heck, Chloe? <laughs> What's wrong with you? He's not, he, Sarah isn't that bad. You're right. I, I just think of him as Neon. In an act of desperation, she had come to the human world and sacrificed my grandfather's life to get there. It was a, cho it was a choice she obviously, she obviously didn't want to make, but she had, she had no choice in the matter on. I felt both pity for her and a small form of torment from the situation. Huh. My grandfather was the man I loved very much. Was the man I loved very much. He, he raised me like his daughter and I didn't get the chance to even say goodbye. Hey, he probably wasn't even going to be hey, alive. I didn't get to say goodbye to my dad. I didn't, anyway. <laughs> he probably wasn't even going to be alive for that much longer. I mean, she only just kind of took away a few years. <laughs> okay, that was done. Oh, wow. Chloe. <laughs> You're so rude. I know, I'm great. 10 out of 10. You're great. Guys, you're so great. And then you're so sympathetic. I know. You it's a tragedy. Guys, probably think of such a, such a heartwarming a person. I can't say tragedy. Stop saying it's a tragedy so many times. Tragedy. Tragedy. Everyone dies, okay? But, yeah. Yay, Neon! <laughs> and so is Sarah. Merry Christmas. Listen, listen, Odom. We, we all live and die. That's... It's good. It's gonna happen to everyone. I know it sucks. Especially it's old people like your grandfather, who would have died anyway without Diana's help. Yeah. I mean, like. Still, I had to understand why. Why curiosity desperately clung to the word. Was there truly no other way? Diana, let's go. <laughs> My grandfather is great. You keep forgetting that you do that voice. Wow. Good job. Well, sorry. Also, Sorry, also, aren't we in the demon world? What the fuck? Yes, we are. But I think we're allowed to go back and forth to the demon world. Oh, that's cool. What? Why? Hello, Diana. Uh, cause why the fuck not? <laughs> Come with me. Visit him. Come with me. Well. I also want to get some Starbucks. You should try it. It's so good. Very well. <laughs> should yes to Starbucks. Diana was surprisingly obedient. We can deny Starbucks. Despite being the one to place my grandfather in the grave. 
She had already proven me her regret and sorrow, but I could tell that she was holding back something. I needed to know what it was and why my grandfather had to die for her. Wow, you are such a nosy person, Odom. Well, that's actually, your grandfather that's... involved! Yeah, I know, but it's actually pretty accurate. I think the real Odom's really nosy, too. <laughs> yeah, she's pretty... She's pretty, um... I she's guess... Got a pretty fat nose. But we still love her. Anyways, um... There had to be something else that she could have done. We tra we traveled in silence to the graves to the grave to the gravestone or graveyard once more, where my grandfather was buried six feet under. Jeez, what the, <laughs> the stone slab was as clean as ever, and no one was around. It was one. It was only. Fitting. Oh wait, is the grandfather's wind powers gonna come back and be like, can you marry? Can, can um we get married and then he has to freaky make his wind powers say yes? Think, if nobody agreed. I don't think Diana and Odom can get married. Christ. Because she's a human and um it would be unacceptable if a demon marries a human, I believe, especially a ruler. So I'm guessing they're just lovers. You say in a game where there are five guys that you can choose to marry? Well, they they love the throne. <laughs> Quit. Done with you. Oh my god. And, and now Sam is on the throne. So Sam is on the throne. Now. He was in the other games, so yes, argument is invalid. But right now he's not. Your argument is still invalid. <laughs> that's that's because we got turned into a to a demon, man. Jeez. It was only fitting at this guy. You know, I'm not. Gonna, I'm not gonna try to convince you. As the cloudy sky above, let the rain above us and um, rain ab fall upon. Oh my us God! And soft mess be quiet. I am tired. It was almost. I don't know what that word is. It was almost picture. Picture quest to stand in the graveyard, graveyard with the with atmosphere, the atmosphere with the, weather the weather was, was giving, giving us. us. Would you stop it? No. Still, we stood at the foot of the grave, staring at the staring engraved at the letters. Engraved Would you stop it? <laughs> Anyways, um, staring at the engraved letters in the stone. I held. I held the black and red. <laughs> We're done. Goodbye. Goodbye. We're done. Okay. Goodbye. Okay. I'm tired, Chloe. I just woke up too. So guess who else is tired? But I'm not in a bad mood, Steph. See. Well, you can try to read me lines. Yes, because I don't have any lines yet currently, and I'm, I'm bored, so. <laughs> well, you are a jerk sometimes. <laughs> I already know that. Thanks for Still, noticing we again. we stood at the foot of the grave, staring at the engraved letters um, in the stone. I held a black umbrella over my head as Diana conjured a, a clear umbrella between, between her and her side. <laughs> oh, she's so beautiful. I saw this oh, picture on Tumblr. <laughs> I don't. I didn't because I don't I go. I saw this Tumblr. because you know why I have no life. No, because you're becoming one of those Tumblr people, which is terrifying. I slipped over to Diana. And I watched as she formed a vase in the leaf, a vase with lilies in her hands, cupping it gently and becoming lost in thought. Oh, the lilies? Is the uh, flowers of lilies? Money check? Okay. I don't know or care. Diana. <laughs> Yes, dear? Can you tell me what happened? Diana stared at me in disbelief and confusion. More Actually, she's still staring at those flowers. I, I think she's mistaking us for the flowers right now. <laughs> what happened? Like, from the beginning, I want to know everything that happened and the way he died. Did he have an overdose of Starbucks? <laughs> Did you get a heart attack from Starbucks? Starbucks. I'm still, I'm still gonna drink it no matter what. Yes. I I have Starbucks is like my life. Can we go to the mall? This bar. <laughs> I want to go to the mall. Oh, you're so insensitive, boy. Okay. So we've already established that. <laughs> you're so insensitive, though. I can't believe it. <sighs> Diana looked back to the grave and pressed her lips together in a fine line before nodding and closing her eyes. I braced myself for a story that I probably didn't want to hear, but it was... Didn't we already I... hear this in Sam's route? Yes, I believe so. 
<laughs> it took you a while to think. Maybe, I'm not sure. I haven't played this episode yet. Don't worry about it. But my, I remember, um, Michaela was streaming and she said that, um, when Diana's telling her, telling us, um, her story, she's literally just telling us her story. And it's gonna sound like some of the stuff we already learned, but then she's gonna meet some other stuff, and yeah. Oh, goody. More I'm things with her. Story what the fuck is that on your desktop? That child in the corner on your desktop is a fucking terrifying. What the actual fuck is that? Are you talking about this? No, on your desktop. The computer, Stephanie. Where? <laughs> what? Do you not know what a desktop is? I don't see it. A desktop is the main homepage of your computer that has all the applications. The thing you are currently staring at is called a desktop. <laughs> Sorry, oh I'm talking about my real life desktop. That's not a de What the fuck is a real life desktop? That's just a desk. It's not a desk. Oh my god. I hear you anyways. Why are you scared? That child is fucking terrifying in like the left Oh, this? Side. Hey, this one? No, the, the, the left. The other side, Stephanie. The other side. Oh, that. <laughs> that fucking terrifying. <laughs> uh, she's talking about the emoji I made um, not too long ago. Anyway, that is fucking terrifying. And now I'm gonna look up the definition of desktop. <laughs> Send it to you. Okay, you're God, get leave me alone. I'm not. Anyways, um, I based this up for a story that I probably didn't want to hear, but it was one that I had to barrel through in order to quell the curiosity in my heart. When I was born, I was brought up to be the perfect princess. I was given lessons on every subject known to the demon world and studied almost endlessly on harnessing my powers and ruling over a kingdom that would one day be mine. Hmm. Did you listen? Partially, no. Partially, I was looking at- No way! I was contemplating that you don't know what a desktop is! Can you just listen to the game? No. <laughs> oh my gosh. You guys see what I have to pit up to every- Yeah, they're up, probably all jealous. I, I began- When I was awesome as I grew so up- That is me. I began to master my powers and eventually became known as the most powerful succubus in the demon world. By the time I was old enough to be, as humans say, a teenager. Her red eyes are pretty. Armies bowed to me in allegiance and obedience. I like how you said that her eyes are pretty when she's talking about her life. Um, well, I'm partially not paying attention to them. I'm partially just staring at the picture. Okay, yeah. It is, it is, she is very beautiful, though. And it's a, be it's a beautiful picture. Yep, and I don't see vinyl at all. <sighs> anyway, so she should be like... What? Well, it could work. She was t stuck in a love triangle with... With us and Saro. Saro can be Neon. Oh my gosh, and Neon's not a bad guy. <laughs> Neon's a fucking evil guy. He's not evil. Yes, he is. Neon's no, evil. No, he isn't. Neon almost made Octavia commit suicide. Well, no. Saro isn't evil. I'm talking about Saro. I'm talking about Neon. Well, yes, Neon is, can be evil for all he cares about. People can write him as evil. Daryl is not evil. I never said he was evil. Okay. I said I hated him, though. <sighs> oh, yeah, and Octavia is us. We are Octavia. Even our parents are dicks. Just like Octavia. See? I mean, our mom <laughs> is very supportive and such, but she can't be a mother to us because of her father, and he's very controlling, and he's an asshole. Anyway. Yeah, see? It's perfect. It's just like that fan fiction with Sassafash. Oh, yeah, now Sarah's Sassafash. Congrats, man. <laughs> I smiled a bit, seeing her lips curl up in a nostalgic grin. I could practically imagine it. Down! Fuck! What? Whoa! We're back in time! That's incredible. God damn it, Doctor Who! Oh, that's the king! That's our... That's our dad. <laughs> really? How long lived the Thank king? You, Daddy. Oh, she sounds so young. Anyways. Long lived the king, I guess. How long? You He's get it? <laughs> He's dead! Yes, that, that was oh, a joke! But um, also, um... He's dead. Also, who play... Uh, also, the people who play as Diana's parents, they're actually Michaela's parents. 
Oh. Which is actually kind of funny because uh, Diana plays as Michaela. Uh, Diana's dead that sister same, is played same. by um, Michaela's you sister. You have told me that <laughs> literally so many it's, times. If I you know, guys but don't so have to, like first seduce me, <laughs> how she said it ten times. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just it's. Just, yeah. Sir, a message. I don't know. I thought it was Sarah. I know. I thought it was Sarah too. Huh. Hand in here. Father? Well, I have to say, I'm very shocked. Oh no, Dear? what happened? Oh, there's the queen. What's going oh, on? No. Oh no. The demon lord is willing to consider our offer. Are you certain? What offer? <sighs> An offer that this oh, oh, oh. kingdom is there. A marriage proposal. I just, I know this part. I'm just like, oh no. A marriage between me and one of his sons? Yes, Diana. Yes, Azir. Are you upset with us? No. I understand. You do? Mm-hmm. If I can help this kingdom by getting married, then I will do it. We're proud of you, dear. We're so happy you understand. <laughs> don't! Don't you tell me! Oh, wait. Okay, we're back after a second. So yeah, the queen's proud of Diana. When I learned of my engagement, I became determined. I was confident in myself that I could protect my kingdom and become both a perfect bride and a perfect queen. My parents met with the demon lord and eventually came back with the name of my intended. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I didn't realize I had to say something. James! Greystal, the eldest son. It only made sense. He was the one in line to take his father's throne, and I was the only child of my family's kingdom. For a while, anyway. Oh. <laughs> I feel sad for sister. Now you feel sad. Not I always felt sad. She was dead. Just this moment, when you learn that. Do you remember? You were reminded that she's dead. A while. Yes, so. Yes, so. Yes. Oh, fuck yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm stupid, I guess. I don't know. Diana's smile brightened a bit more as she closed her eyes and chuckled to herself. In my kingdom, the rulers are charged with only giving birth to one child per generation to ensure that there is no slaughter for the throne. However, as I reached adulthood, I was told that I was no longer going to be an only child. Huh. Yay! Mother? Father, you wish to speak to me? Oh, in the training room. Cool. Isaiah, we have Random. something very important to tell you. We had sex! What? what is it? <laughs> <laughs> yes, they had sex, and now they have a baby! No, seriously, I think that's now how I think anytime somebody announces that they're pregnant, or somebody, like, in TV or in real life is pregnant, I'm just like, oh, so they had sex. How else do you think? Okay, there are other ways to get pregnant, though. Yeah, I know, but that's just originally what I think of. But there are other ways people can get pregnant. Yeah, but that's what, just what I think of. And normally, if they have to do it another way, that means that they failed at having sex. <laughs> so they probably that's have. So loud! You don't know, like, what if there's something wrong with the man or the woman? Yeah, and they would have figured that out by having sex. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is so just terrible. Your this life is terrible. This is just, I'm sorry, people are trying to get pregnant. <laughs> You're sorry, people are trying to get pregnant. I'm sorry to, to the people who are trying to get pregnant. I'm sorry. <laughs> why, why are you sorry? No, oh, no. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. Is there? I'm pregnant. What? You're pregnant yes diana she said she was pregnant you're gonna be a wow. big sister diana you're a fucking genius holy <laughs> shit. yes you will be having a sibling i was astonished I, honestly well i didn't know mind. how to act to such news i knew of our family's traditions so i was stunned i was going to have a younger sibling oh wait what you can, say? now what i wanted to say was if it was me if they were like diana i'm pregnant i would be like oh so you guys had sex or i didn't know you said yes yeah 
They probably- Or they'd be they like, probably, oh, they oh, no, no, the Stork brought it. <laughs> no, they actually do not care, um, about, about it, because, um, because for oh, yeah, sex they, demons, like, they it's They fuck normal. in the other room. Like that one fan fiction I read that broke my heart. <laughs> uh, Chloe. Anyways. Beat me on with a stick. Please, say something. I... I... Finally, as it all settled in, I was overjoyed. The thought of having a younger sibling was too exciting to hold in. When I would be in the Demon Lord's castle being a queen, my parents would be able to bring up a new heir to take my place. Huh. I'm so happy. This is wonderful. I remember the joyful looks on my parents' faces when I told them of my excitement. I would later learn that the baby would be a girl. <laughs> a younger sister. This is what makes you question, like, how do they know it was a girl? Like, did they use, like, magic or something? I don't fucking know oh, They probably did. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just thinking now about sex. That I was probably not a good idea. <sighs> I, I, I blame fan fictions. It's always about the sex, isn't it? Okay. Yes, it's all Somnion's fault. Ah, uh, dang it, Neon. I blame you for ruining my best friend's life. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Neon. <laughs> Anyways. <clears throat> oh, jeez, my voice, okay. <laughs> oh, come on. Ah, oh, donkey. Okay. Okay, do your... Do your thing. I don't want to. Okay. What will her name be? What will her name? She's fucking dead, Odom. You would say, what was her name going to be? Okay, fuck you, Odom. Odabel. I was given the option to name her, and my parents accepted it. <laughs> One time, actually, I was given the choice to name my cousin, and they liked the name, but then they changed the name because... <laughs> I don't know. What? <laughs> Okay, so one time when I was like, uh, like a year or two ago, I um, was given an option to name my new baby cousin um, in Indonesia, and I named him a pretty uh, sophisticated name, and then they liked it, but then they changed it. Oh, <laughs> that's depressing. Yep. I was like so happy they decided to like it, then they're like, nah, never mind, let's just do this thing. <laughs> but whatever, and at least I have a new baby cousin. Um. That's a beautiful name. <laughs> Diana smiled and nodded in agreement. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Holy shit, you're dying. Sorry. Oh, Jesus Christ. Sorry, I just. <laughs> this happens to me in the morning. This happens to me in the morning. Like um, it it, it just does. I don't know why. Um. Her eyes painted her longing, her longing, um, per perfectly in her expression. Okay. I cannot wait to see her. When I left, she was still within my mother's womb. Oh. Cool. Oh, I remember the story. You left before Or- Orbel? Orbel. Orbel? Before Arabelle was a barn, was there like a sale at the mall or something and you really had to get out or what? why? Dude, remember the deal? Nobody cares! Damn it, we're talking about malls! And Starbucks! Yes. Gosh! I had little choice in the matter. What? What do you mean the wedding is dissolved? Uh, I'm sorry, princess. The demon lord's sons have disappeared. Oh, that's This can't be. No, I must... I must speak to the Demon Lord. Princess? I must speak to him! When I learned of the boy's disappearance, and the possibility of my marriage dissolving, I panicked and rushed to the Demon Lord, begging to allow me to find his sons and bring them back. I was thankful that he agreed, and I spent every waking moment I had trying to find their trail. When I oh. did... I ripped it open and came through myself without a second thought. I still remember that day. Oh no. A Kate spell. How could I have been so blind? They didn't just vanish. They left this plane for the human world. Damn it. Oh, My princess. No. What should I tell the d d demon lord? Wait, wait. 
Why is it so true? Huh. So what right now? There. Nothing. Tell him I found out where his sons have gone. Once you <laughs> 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 Oh my <laughs> gosh, Sally! <laughs> <laughs> you raised! You raised so much! <laughs> Why not? Okay, we're back. Um. Tell him I found out where his sons have gone. Once you deliver the message, go back to Lilith Castle. Back to the castle? But what about- I'm going to the human world alone. Oh my god, I keep you thinking that's fucking You need to send words to tell them what happened. What? I keep thinking that's fucking Saro. Maybe it is Saro. It's probably Saro. Probably, I'm not sure. But what will I say? I mean, he- I mean- hmm. Tell them their daughter is protecting them. If they demand an explanation, tell them everything. Now go. As you wish. Your Highness. All right. Time to find my husband. I recast the spell and found myself entering a hospital where your grandfather was visiting. As the gateway closed, your grandfather took his last breath and passed away before he even realized what was happening. How could he... <clears throat> huh. How could he have not known? I mean, God. I was draining his life energy to maintain the connection to him through the gate spell. I overpowered his will to fight back and locked his focus so he couldn't see me coming. That's underhanded. That's the instincts of a demon. We strategize and overpower our targets so that we can take advantage of them. Human or demon. <sighs> Diana let out a sad sigh before gripping the vase in her hand. <clears throat> the moment he took his last breath was the moment I realized what I had done and became wracked with guilt. I ran as far as I could and wallowed in what I had done to that man, questioning everything I was doing and why I was doing it. But soon enough, I became filled with purpose once more. I had to find the boys. I had done too much damage to try and turn back. So I had to go all of the way. I shook my grief out and returned to my hunt. Then you found a May and I'm so fabulous. <laughs> I don't think I'll, I don't think that I don't think the real old one would be like, I'm so fabulous at this sad moment. I'm an angel. Look at that angel. <laughs> Yes! She would be like Dad and Diana would be like, Angels are not beautiful, sweetie. I'm the angel! You're not an angel, sweetie. Angels are I ugly and they have three wings. That's weird. Then I found you, dear. Diana looked to me, her eyes full, full of ge guilt and self-reflection. I can never take back what happened. If there was any way I could undo what I had done, then I would. I am truly... And deeply sorry. You know? Our grandfather was the one who started all this. We didn't start. <laughs> so, in all <laughs> retrospect, it was it should be us apologizing to Diana. What? In all retrospect, we're the ones who should be should be apologizing to Diana. Yo, shut up. <laughs> hey! It's okay, at least now I know. Diana was genuine enough to open up to me about the about the ordeal. It almost looked like a heavy weight had been lifted off of her shoulders just from that side as Kedra looked at my reply. As she looked back to the grave, the grave uh, she kneeled down and placed the vest on the, t on the gravestone. I wonder what my parents will think. I'm sure they'll understand, Diana. <laughs> or not. I'll get to see them soon enough, I suppose. Whenever I return. Yeah. And Orbeal. Or Orbeal, Orbeal. Orbeal. Or Orbeal. Or Bob, Orbeal. <laughs> Orbeal. Orba. <laughs> Diana's smile returned at the sound of her sister's name. And Orbeal. I'll finally be able to meet her. And Eric's value, uh, never mind. What or, were you gonna say? Nothing. 
Anyways, I'm however, despite the words that uh, range out from her lips, her hand gently grasps mine. I still have more to teach you, so I will not be leaving yet. I felt glad that she was willing to stay and teach me, and keep teaching me despite what had happened. Edumacation. Oh, I just dropped my water bottle. Edumacation. <laughs> While it was her punishment for killing my grandfather to tell me everything she knew, she was willing to stay and keep her word, word instead of running back to where her family was. I felt a bit honored. <clears throat> I'm glad. Thank you. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe I'll bring you back with me so you can meet my parents and sister as well. Really? For a while, anyway. I'll have to take care of the demon lord, since I failed to find his sons. Oh, wait a minute. Is this before the second game? No, this is during the this is during the second game. This is, but isn't she saying that we're gonna go meet her family? Oh yeah, this is before this. Oh yeah, the second game starts with them going to the demon world. This is before it. Bobby. Oh my gosh! <laughs> wow, that makes what? so much sense. Actually, I thought it was gonna be like that because the other stories were. Hi, I'm glad I figured it out. Oh, sorry. Anyways, I'm sure you will. I'm sure you'll be fine or something. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Fine or something. Anyways, um, do your thing, girl. Yeah, I'm sure you'll be fine. You sound even more white girlish. <laughs> the fuck you. <laughs> now they're dead. <laughs> yep, they're dead. And <laughs> it's our fault. <laughs> wow, that's now that all that whole thing is even worse because she doesn't know that they're dead, and we do. I mean. They die when she comes back. Yeah, I know. But we, but, but we currently know that they're dead. I mean, they're going to be dead. And we know that, but she doesn't. So it's depressing. God, we are. I'm a fucking ass hat. No, but the thing is, um, the demon lord has kept an eye on her. Like he, like he had someone watching her from the human, in the from the human world. And once he found out that Diana had stopped looking for the boys, um, he planned to um, kill um, her family and destroy her kingdom when she comes back. Like, right well, when she comes back. Well, that's depressing. Yeah, yeah. that is depressing. Yeah, he, he is an asshole. Anyways, how do you like the story, Chloe? It's kind of boring. Okay. <laughs> anyway, there's a hashtag long live the queen, demon queen, down there. Well, if she's the demon queen, then yeah, she'll long live, but if it's the other demon queen, now nah, she's dead. <laughs> what? <are you> <laughs> oh my gosh, Chloe. I know, I'm such anyway, a Anyway, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I shall put a link below to where you can play this, and yeah. Um, hope you guys like this video, and Chloe, do you, do you have any last words to say? Because this I realized where this story took place faster than the person who played all the games. Whatever, anyways. Um, <gasps> You're jealous, huh? I'm not jealous. Sure. Anyways, so. Hey, guys, do you think that she's jealous? Comment down below if you think Stephanie's jealous. Okay. <laughs> okay, whatever, but, um... So, yeah, um, last words besides that, Chloe. I'm the predictor, motherfuckers. You're a predictor. I'm the predictor, motherfuckers. You're a predictor. The predictor. You're a predictor. I'm the predictor. You're a predictor, Chloe. Listen to her. She's not. She's crazy. I'm the predictor. Bye, guys. <laughs> You're crazier. Anyways. Bye, guys. Bye.